Hey, this is uh, me from Tiger to Schooling, and uh, today I'm uh, I'm showing you some skills that I have learned a long time ago in accessing dark web. And uh, two years back, one of my video was taken down by YouTube for violating its policies on accessing dark web. And at this time, I'm being a little bit cautious in case if this video is being taken down. Uh, consider it uh, as a plus point if you see it earlier as early as possible and uh, you should watch this video completely because you won't be able to learn these steps anywhere else today I will teach you how to access the dark web on any Android phone that you're using these steps can work on an iPhone but on iPhone there are certain there is a VPN that you have to you know use another VPN but uh, today uh, the thing is I'll teach you from the beginning how you can access it and how you can go into certain websites <clears throat> and uh, make sure uh, through, throughout the whole steps we will stay cautious and uh, make sure that we have the maximum anonymity and uh, to, uh, to have the maximum anonymity we will use certain settings in, in that browser that we are particularly using to accessing dark web because dark web cannot be accessed through Google Chrome or Safari. If anybody out there is teaching you uh, that, uh, he is he's genuinely fooling you. And uh, today the method that I'm going to teach you is proven method. And there is no faking in it. There is no call it Linux involved. There is nothing involved. It's an easy web accessed method. So you won't be needing multiple methods or app to access it. Uh, without further, uh, I'll, I'll just get started. I'll tell you just follow my steps on how I access dark web and follow what I say. Make sure follow my uh, important settings throughout the, you know, stay very cautious on what I apply and what I don't apply. And uh, that will keep your anonymity to yourself so you will stay out of trouble. I am not currently in the United States, so that's why I won't be affected by these settings or anything that I make. So if you're living outside the United States, you don't have to might you don't you might not have to worry about this. But if you're living in the United States, it might affect you. But don't worry, it won't cause you any any trouble if you browse it safely. I'll teach you how you can do that, so it will make you out of trouble. So without further ado, let's follow my, uh, you know, cell phone screen. Uh, you can see the trouble in my voice while making this because I made it last time, and it affected it. <laughs> I make sure it won't affect it now. Um, okay, let's. Uh, without further, let's get started. The first, what you have to do is, uh, I have to open up my laptop, to mobile cell phone, and. Uh, Okay, the first thing you have to do is when you are using an Android phone, you must have uh, this application called uh, Vapnify. This is for VPN. I have used multiple you know, VPNs, but they don't you know, properly work on this. So this is the really important VPN you need. M make sure you use this VPN because I have tested multiple VPNs across the board. And this seems very, very you know, secure comparing, comparing to other VPNs. So make sure you download this VPN from the App Store or if you're using the you know Google App Store, I think I'm an iPhone user, so I'm teaching this on and you know Android phone. The second, you need a, a Tor browser. You can also get this Tor browser application from your Google Play Store. Uh, if you have a Google Play Store, just what you have to do is go on Google Play Store and write down Tor browser. So this way, uh, you will be needing <coughs> this one, the Tor browser that is on the top. Just get it through. Make sure it has 4.3 ranking and 175,000 reviews. And this is the really, uh, you know, important. So this has 10 million views. So this is a really, there are multiple uh, Onions websites. You don't need to go through them. The Tor browser is the best Onion websites. I'll tell you what Onion websites are in, 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 in further in this video. Just close this Tor browser and, and we will go through the Vipnify. This is a VPN. And this is the VPN that we are using, and this is you have to download this one as well. So these two things, when you have those two things, the first method what you have to do is go through the first. Don't open the VPN. I'll, I'll tell you when you have to open the VPN to stay secure as much as possible. First, go to Tor browser, and when you get into Tor browser, click on Connect, 
uh, when you have downloaded, you have got through the steps, it will, you know, it will make sure that uh, you are have you are having the maximum anonymity, which Google doesn't provide because Google tracks everything through cache and cookies. So you don't have to worry about in, uh, this in this settings. And we'll go through the settings in this on the tired browser. You can see when it opens, if it does not connect, wait for a few seconds. Okay, when you are when you, it's connected, you can see such type of uh, the screen. Some people call it an interface, whatever you call it. I don't mind when you have this type of screen. Just you can see there are three dots in the right lower corner. You can see that in the lower side. Just click on those three dots and you will arrive at this setting. And click on the settings. Uh, we will apply some settings so and because we have to stay safe and secure in this setting what you have to do is come down first of all you have to reach out to security so in this security we have three three options we have a standard we have safer and we have safest so the standard one is usually not that much safe but in standard you the thing in the standard uh, op uh, you know option you have access to all the videos uh, you know you, you can watch youtube you can watch other videos like it's not that much safe it can still track your cookies still track your location so standard is not safe because you can see the, they can track your location or anything through pictures uh, that you watch so standard is not much safe safer is really good uh, it actually disables uh, those websites uh, that are usually harmful or potentially that you know sometimes the website doesn't have a proper link or they're not ssl secured you should not you you uh they are set there you know if you use safer option then this one is a really good option the, com the third one is safest in the safest it is completely blocking all the tracking uh, sites which means no media images or uh, through anything that you cannot be tracked so safest is a great option but the problem with the safest one you can we won't be able to see any images that you want to actually see so we won't actually use safest because we want to see such images or such products that we are looking for so we use the safer option because it's in the middle uh, we will do another setting so this will protect us and make us in such a way it will provide us that will we will be lying in the category of the safest option so we'll stay to safest and go and when you click on safest go back don't use the standard just stay on safest and other option you have to go in https only mode you have to make sure you have to make sure when you when, when you open it it's actually disabled what you have to do is actually enable it when you enable it, what it does, it automatically attempts to connect the sites using HTTPS encryption protocol for increased security. It will avoid all the other failed links to be connected or getting your location. So we will en enable this one and we make sure that we enable it for all tabs. We won't, don't want to stay on only on private tabs. We want to enable it on tabs. So we go back. These are the two main websites the third option you have to do is make sure to prioritize the onion sites onion sites are those sites which are working in layers which means if you are one on one website if somebody's trying to track your location it will not be seen like uh, the layers of onion when somebody's trying to peel it you will see another layer in, in, the, in the inside so your location is kind of an inside of an onion the inside layer that someone is trying to track you from outside can't actually reach you until he will have to get through all the layers so that's why it's called an onion if you want to enable it just enable this one as well and in this way you are actually you know uh uh, having a greater way to be secure on this website now further on if you want to you know double double save this one we can browse through this option but in case if you want to double save it we go back and we go back and we go to the vpn that we have just downloaded so it's kind of a double pro uh, doubly protect us through what we are tracking just we have to click on this one repnify and we will we'll just say we'll click on connect and we'll wait for a few seconds and so that now boom we are connected so we have this kind of a speed and we go back so there's an also ad block for all apps which we the apps that are running ads so you can use this one for other you know websites as well but i'm using it currently for you know uh, for tar accessing tar browser so i go back and i go back again to tar browser um, you know to confirm it make sure you confirm it again go to settings and see if your settings are preserved go to settings and security setting you can see that your settings are preserved once you feel like your settings are preserved and you're totally in the secure environment just go into search engine and search for dog 
web or deep web site links you can search for it uh, due to a trouble in android phone uh, I'm, I'm, i was not a being able to you know use it properly because i'm not an android user so i switched over to my iphone to show you the further steps uh, once you have downloaded the tar browser and uh, you have done the, all the process it's the same further on you don't have to worry about anything it's the same thing i told you to search for dark web sites list just search for that dark website lists and once you search it just wait for it, it will search through DuckDuckGo it's a safe browsing site so I'll just you know increase my brightness and in here you will see multiple sites to you know there are 25 best dark websites for 2023 there are multiple options you don't have you you don't worry about that I'm telling you what to do next just click on one of the websites and uh, wait for a few seconds and in here you can see there are multiple sites uh, explaining what you should do and what you should not do uh, the most prominent website that people most teach is the hidden wiki it's the wikipedia that uh, there there are there are certain articles on this hidden wiki that they are not available on the wikipedia that is uh, normally available on your google browser there are certain things that nobody's going to tell you the secret passwords the secret wealth anything that you search that the secret billionaires the people th doing illegal works uh, this can be found this can be found on you know this uh, what you call this uh, hidden wiki there's an option called Daniel which provides you know uh, to navigate easily through dark web so this is again another website called sci-hub it actually have scientific papers and research and there are experts in various fields which means there are certain uh, research works that are not published or not uh, in free version available on normal Google Chrome so you have you can access them for free on this uh, you know dark web sci-hub website and there's again there's a uh, website called hidden answers so this is a platform of the dark web where you can ask questions without getting censored normally you know on uh, there, there are certain questions you cannot ask on Quora or such websites but on hidden answers you can ask those questions purely free of any trouble on the other hand if you, you might be seeing Facebook and the BBC so these are actually mirrors of uh, Facebook and BBC which means the Facebook and BBC can also be ac accessed on dark web as well because they have this access uh, on this website so again there's another website this is really really important most of the routers uh, use it the routers website you might have heard it most of them and most of news agency use this one called secure drop this is actually designed for whistleblowers uh, to share information with journalists securely and anonymously which means you can share the uh, the anonymity the the, the you know uh, you know uh, the information's online. There is certain one more thing that I can show you on my laptop screen uh, That is I have used it multiple times. I can show you this one that it's not me uh, This is not me bragging about dark web. There are certain things. I'm not talking uh, you might be understanding why I'm not talking because uh, you know uh, but if you want to access something that you are expecting from this video you can write down and further get into these links and you will be you will see wonders on what can be accessed I can show you on my this laptop screen that I have tar browser on top of my screen in search bar so this is normally I use tar browser in here I access it through my laptop this is because I totally I have to day and night work on this website there are certain things that I get downloaded there are there are certain works that I needed from tar browser there are certain things that I'm not talking about are available in this dark websites so this is me uh, giving you an example how you can access dark web and further on if you search properly for dark web sites link and you just write down onions do not access websites that is end with dot com and uh, I'm not going into those things I'm just telling you just do what I'm telling you just write down a uh, search for that website or write down dark web sites and in the end make sure you write onion sites because onion sites are the most secured sites and can you can easily access what you are expecting from this video 
and if you think that you have accessed that thing that you are expecting make sure you follow follow my further videos and let me know in the comment until this video is available on YouTube make sure you watch it and once it's taken down uh, I hope I, I, I might have a bad luck but until it's not taken down I, I give you a good luck and I hope you enjoy this video uh, thank you and I uh, hope I'm not in trouble and this is for educational purpose thank you very much